are, do you want an egg bite? No. No. Say good morning to all these people. You kept us up all night. Did you have a night terror last night? Yeah. You did? Well, yeah. I'd love to. We don't have to get it so upset. Uh, oh, look, mommy's making you one of these. Let me open it. No. Oh, you did. What a good boy. Thank you. Just got done vacuuming, but I wanted to show you my cute mom I got. Isn't she pretty? There's Spidey! We just got up at 3.30 this morning and I don't know if we're gonna make it to nap time at noon. It's only 9.30. <laughs> Cruz called into his bed and said he was tired, and now he's doing this when I shut the door. So, we're gonna see if he'll go down for an early nap since he's been up since 3.30. And I am going to set up the garage for pumpkin carving and painting. So that's what we're going to do here. And then I might rest as well. I did set up like trays for things, um, for snacks. These are like just desserts and snacks. And then we might do s'mores if it is not raining. So if we do, I'm going to open all that and make like a s'mores tray. And then all this is going in the garage but like i said we're just doing pizza so i'm gonna put the pizza on the stove right here we got like five pizzas um and i got a big caesar salad i'm gonna put like right here and then i have a veggie tray i'm gonna sit on here too and then i'll do my punch and stuff over in the corner and then other drinks are in the garage so it's kind of our just easy setup i vacuumed the couch but sister got on it and she's so tired dougie kept us up all night didn't he? and doug's passed out moved all of Cruz's toys that were right here in his room, which is what he's playing with. So this opens up things a little bit. Spidey's out now. I already changed my mind, but this is the pumpkin carving table, probably for the adults. It has all a or the hiccups too. The templates if they want to use, it came with some. Um, this is one kit, this is another kit. We have tons of pumpkin stuff and this is just a bunch of pumpkin stuff in a bucket. So this is the table for pumpkin carving. Then I figured the toddlers, they could eat dinner out here. Also, we're gonna have a space heater going to make it a little warmer in here. Um, we really wanted to do like a bonfire and be outside, but it's gonna be a little too cold. So I put a little fun, I'm gonna light these up when it comes time, um, but just the teeth and the spider rings, these two kids tables we have, our neighbor gave us this one. So it's really nice we have it. And then just have some open space for people to stand, have their own chairs and get comfy. Um, Scott cleaned some of this out. We kind of have a lot in our garage, but I was gonna put painting on the floor. So for like toddlers, I got um, or babies. I got just some washable paint. It's literally going to come right off when the rain or whatever, but a bucket for water. And then, actually, I'm probably going to have to get two cups or whatever for water. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go get two cups for water, some paper uh, plates to put the paint on, and then some 
paper towels, of course, and then all these brushes that Cruz had in his room. Hopefully we can do a little fire. If so, we got some of this stuff. And then we got some glow masks for the kids and like a necklace thing. I don't know, just something fun. I have a few minutes to get ready. What is that? Cruz? Okay, my kid is obsessed with Moto 7 the movie. Like I said, I haven't got a grip on this freaking TV, but when I'm home alone and I have stuff to do, this is how I can get stuff done. Cruz just woke up not that long ago. Shoot, I should have grabbed my makeup before filming. Cruz woke up a little bit ago. He took a two and a half hour nap, but he did wake up in the middle of it. I had got the garage all set up. I had vlogged a little bit of it and kind of got everything laid out in the kitchen as much as I can before I can put like the salad and like veggie tray out. I don't even know what time it is currently, but Cruz is entertained at the moment. So I figured I would get ready. I jumped in the shower and body showered. I'm just going to wear leggings since it's not my house. I'm going to do leggings and I have this like skeleton, two skeletons like dancing crew neck thing that I'm going to wear that I never really get to wear. So I feel like I have to wear it during Halloween time. I'm not gonna put like a bunch of makeup on, but I am gonna put a little bit on because of my zits. Cruz took a two and a half a nap, that's where I was going with this, and woke up like an hour and 20 minutes into it, like crying for mommy. So I went in there and cuddled him and I fell asleep with him. We both, he wasn't ready to get up, but he had woke up just a little bit, I guess just wanting me scared, I don't know. Um, so we both fell asleep. <laughs> I woke up and snuck out because I was gonna go ahead and jump in the shower. And I ended up eating something and then by the time that was done, he was awake. So, I am now just gonna put a little bit of makeup on and do my hair. Everyone's coming over around five, or at least that's what I like planned for. Scott had to work today. I don't know if I've talked to the camera really much. Cruz woke up at 3.30 this morning wanting me to turn his sound machine off and basically start his day. So I brought him to our bed and it took him quite a bit. It was almost like he wasn't quite awake. He kind of had another temper tantrum or like a uh, night terror. I guess they're not temper tantrums. I don't know why he keeps getting them and it breaks my heart. I'm gonna talk to his doctor about it. Oh, dropped concealer. Never really truly went back to sleep. Then my bulldog decided he was having like stomach issues and he kept making like these weird noises and he wouldn't lay down. It was just like, it's a rough morning. So we basically were up from 3.30 on. Um, Scott had to get up at four for work. He had to work this weekend. This Saturday, one of the jobs about an hour and 15 minutes away needed a safety guy. And that's what Scott does for a living for his company. He works for AT Abatement um, or AT Industries. I guess there's like multiple companies within, but um, he's the safety guy. I just put that on my sheet. That's not what I want to do. He is the safety guy for the company. So that is totally his job to go do that this weekend. And so he got up and did that. We tried to sleep again, but we kind of just got up. We got up at like 5.30 when he got up. We watched a little bit of Paw Patrol in bed. And then got up and started our day. And I started on the kitchen. Cruz and I took many breaks to play. We colored, ate snacks. <laughs> Those once upon a farm pouches I got yesterday at Costco. I think I just wasted my money. Cruz tried the kale and apple, which is the one like I for sure thought he'd like. Picked his swigs and basically said, ew, I don't like that and gave it back to me. So I'm gonna have to give those to some friends or something because I don't want them to go to waste. There's like eight pouches. This is like cute little <laughs> crew neck. I actually don't love the color of it. It's from Shein, which I know is like frowned upon to shop from, but it was like $5. But this color and this color and like the neck color and this are like different. Do you see how it's like a lighter? So it looks, I don't know, it looks a little weird, but I never get to wear this. I wear it like once a year. I feel like you could wear this all the time. I just, I don't. I feel like it's Halloween-y. So that's what I'm wearing today and I just have leggings on, socks and slippers. We got this spooky juice. You can put eyeballs or worms in it. I just opened one of these Magnum bottles. This is the 18th anniversary blend from Cooper's Talk. In our wine membership that we have, you get like, this bottle is massive. I don't know if you can tell. I'll get a regular bottle. Dougie! Oh 
Okay, that's a normal size wine bottle and then that's the Magnum. So, I'm opening one of these tonight in hopes someone will help me drink it because I have two of these of two different kinds, but I don't know when I'll ever drink it. So rainy and gross. We have like ponds <laughs> happening in the backyard. There's so much rain and so much freaking mud. and painting we had a full house a few people couldn't even make it and the house was still so packed say hi <laughs> you ready yeah one two you're being silly now Paw Patrol. Are you hoping daddy do graphics? Eat some applesauce. Ready for race weekend next weekend? Mm-hmm. You gonna race your stacy tomorrow next weekend? Yeah. Yeah, you, you gotta ride it though. You gotta We gotta learn it. to ride it first. Uh, oh the Nice work, bub. Hi. Hey, Chris. Can you ask him nicely? Can you say, Doug, will you please move? <laughs> okay, I'll help. I'll help. Okay, take it up on the couch. Watch out for your bike. Yeah. You want some help? Got my new Nespresso order in. I tried the new flavors. I got peppermint, yeah. pinwheel, 
Hold on, baby. Sweet vanilla. I really do like. I've had it before. Yes, Cruz. It's okay. Rich chocolate, and then the rest are all new too. Oh, sweet vanilla again. And golden caramel. So the golden caramel, rich chocolate, and peppermint pinwheel were one of the like seasonal flavors that had like the best reviews. The living room's a wreck, but you're having so much fun, aren't you? Shake it, baby. Are you Marshall? I need to take all my Halloween stuff down. I got the urge to take all my decor down because I want to put Christmas up after next weekend. Bath time, we got our jammies, and I always lay his clothes out for the next day. So pants, a shirt, socks, and shoes so I can grab it. You like it? Wanna jump? One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs>